Good morning. I'm Tiara, and you're watching Verses of the Day with T. Today's verse comes from the book of Psalms, chapter 143, verse 8. Before we get into the initial reading of God's word, we pray. So, let's pray. Dear Lord, Heavenly Father, we thank you for waking us up this morning and starting us on our way. Lord, we thank you for bringing 2020 to an end. We thank you for all that you have in store for 2021. We ask that you continue to mold us and shape us into the sons and daughters that you have called us to be. We thank you for spiritual awakening. We thank you for a closer relationship with you. We thank you for our health. We thank you for our wealth. God bless our family and God bless our friends. Lord, we trust you and we praise you. We need you. Amen and amen and amen. All right, let's hop into the word. Psalms 143, 8, let me hear of your unfailing love each morning, for I am trusting you. Show me where to walk, for I give myself to you. Let me hear of your unfailing love each morning. Each morning when you get into your word and you spend time with God, it's a reminder of his promise and of his commitment and his unfailing love to you. We talked about unfailing love last week. No matter the circumstance, no matter the situation, no matter how you feel about yourself, no matter about what the world feels about you, no matter about what your family feels about you. God loves you no matter what. And his love is unshakable undescribable, unimaginable, and most importantly, unfailing. Show me where to walk. I pray this. Um, sometimes when I pray with you guys, I say, anoint me to speak. Um, I talk about ordering our steps. Every day when you wake up, as you walk out the door, simply ask God, Lord, what would you have me to do for this day? Lord, Align my steps where you need me to go, who you need me to come in contact with. Use me to impact. You hear me talk about using me to impact lives in a major way. Whatever that means. Sometimes I don't even know. Just use me, though. I am here. I am a vessel. I am a servant. Use me to impact. Somebody might need a hug today. Somebody might need a compliment this morning. Somebody might need a nice word. Somebody might just need a listening ear. Somebody might need encouragement, motivation this morning. Lord, we rebuke all discouragement, all anxiety, all depression, all fears, all 2021, because we're going to put you first and we're going to ask you to lead us and guide us on this journey. I give myself to you. Surrender. Surrender to God, surrender to him and let him lead you and guide you. He's not going to stir you wrong because he's your creator and he already knows the purpose and the plan that he has for your life. So you got the access. Ask. You have not because you ask not. You have not because you believe not. Believe that God is on your side, that his love for you is unfailing, that he has a purpose and a plan for you, and that he is going to exceedingly and abundantly surpass anything you can think or imagine. But it starts with you. You got to seek him. He's not seeking you. He's got all these children all over the world. He's got the whole world in his hands. He, you in his hands too. But we got free will. And we got the, the ability to move and go how we want to go. So when you feel yourself getting lost, when you feel yourself feeling empty and you feel in a void, tap back in. It's okay. Sometimes we fall off the horse. It's just like any goal. Each and every day you wake up is a fresh day day and a fresh start. I love y'all. I hope that everybody is safe tonight. Happy New Year's Eve. This is the last day of 2020. Thank you, Jesus. We made it. Make today count. Have Spend time with family if you can. And I love you. I'll see y'all tomorrow. Thanks for watching. Have a great day on purpose. We in this together. Let's keep growing and glowing in Christ together.